A disco with the Christians. It's not all cliche. Our end of exam party doesn't have to mean prayer group and orange squash. So you are going? Well, like I said to Jar Jar, when you call yourself a Christian, everyone thinks they have the right to mock. It is free orange squash, isn't it? <laughs> you see? This is how come a cliche is a cliche, bruv, yeah? Have you been drinking? It says no drinking. I've been drinking. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> you see, a cliche is a cliche, yeah? Because it has to be at least 90% true, bruv. Yeah, but it's chasing that 10% that's the kick. In it, Matthew. What? You see that? Bru they're faking fans. We look at them, they're never saw Christians. No, 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 no. Now, now, we are drinking, yeah? Alright? Come. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, look, it's all about cause and effect here, bro. The old woman theory again. No, 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 look, 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 look. It does work in theory, all right? All right, all right, look, look, all right. Pick a cougar, any cougar. One that's open to suggestion, all right, as your cause. Because they've got all that experience and know where to put it, right? Do you not think I know this? Oh, yeah, so you appeal to their motherly nature. Their womanly bosom. Wait till she mash up, yeah? And then bish bash bosh. Element of surprise, maximum effect, alright? Watch and learn, bruv. It's gonna slap your face, whichever one you choose. I, I bet you ten pounds you slap shit Alright, alright. Cool, well, let's have a practice run then, yeah? Orange squash? No, you can't. Oh, yeah, I will, thank you. Oh, my eye. Alright, alright, oh. darling. So now you got, you got something in your eye. Yeah. Here I have this, this very beautiful woman in it. Oh! Jacob. But I, I couldn't really help myself. Outside. Now. Fun? We? Where you could. Where's your respect, boy? I mean, we invite you in here. We show you our hospitality. He's sorry. Look, say you're sorry. Oh, come on, you man. Throw it in our faces. Is it my fault that Denise is a beautiful woman? You better leave. Oh, whatever, man. I'm gonna get my jacket. Is it my fault, yeah, that Denise was a bit mash up and bored off her head? Huh? That woman, that woman you disrespect and slander is my wife, yeah? My wife, in the eyes of God. Look, repeat goodness. the words. See, do you even know the words? The words what God has put together, let no man, no man, no, no little disrespectful, sordid boy child take advantage and take the rise and put us under. No man, do you understand? I take that serious, you know. Stop it now. Dad, leave That's it. my wedding vows. Yeah? Do you want to know how serious I take my wedding vows? Do you? Do you? Yo, Vicar, man, chillax. Oh, for shut up! Well, what's he wetting himself about, anyway? I only kissed her. We didn't even do no tongues, man. I just kissed her. Do you get some kind of kick? Are you actively trying to embarrass me? I'm so sorry. No. Me. Why is it always me? How can you like another man touching you? Well, at least he wouldn't touch me. Uh, of course he didn't touch me. He is a kid. For God's sake. Okay, will you listen to me? Please. Of course I didn't like it. It was just a bit of fun at the party, Lucas. Please. What? What's the matter with you? Where's he going? Mum, who's going to take care of all this stuff? Oh, I don't know. Just let her deal with it. You can practice your patronising, can't you? Denise, look, I was defending your honour. You're loving it, ain't you? Hey? <laughs> look at you. Jumped up. Pumped up. Smug little...